Hey everyone, welcome back to IdeaPlex. What if I told you that everything you're seeing right now was generated in real time by AI? That this isn't a filter or some post-production wizardry, but a full-on live transformation of video? Welcome to the world of Mirage by Descartes AI, where the line between real and unreal disappears before your eyes. So what exactly is Mirage? Imagine you're running your webcam, a gameplay stream, or even just sitting through a boring Zoom call and it instantly transforms into something out of a movie or a dream. Picture your feed reimagined as Cyberpunk Tokyo, Studio Ghibli style animation, or even a Roman Empire submerged underwater. Mirage, powered by a model called Mirage LSD, that's live stream diffusion, lets you do exactly that. It takes any live video input and transforms it into stunning stylized visuals instantly. Unlike other AI video tools that spit out a few seconds of pre-rendered content, Mirage is built for infinity. It keeps going, no breaks, no lag. Just a continuous, immersive stream of whatever your imagination can conjure. Now let's peek under the hood. Mirage LSD uses what's called a causal auto-regressive architecture, which means each new frame is built based on the ones that came before, like a painter who never lifts the brush from the canvas but that alone isn't enough to make it fast or stable. Mirage also uses some clever tech tricks, things like diffusion forcing and history, augmentation to avoid the visual drift that usually plagues real-time generative models. Mirage generates at about 20 frames per second with latency under 100 milliseconds, that's faster than a blink. It's been optimized right down to the GPU level, especially on Nvidia Hopper chips to keep everything running smoothly, even during long sessions. Why does this matter? Because we're talking about real-time world building. Imagine streaming a Minecraft session where your blocks look like Lego. Or going live on TikTok while your entire room turns into a vaporwave dream. Mirage isn't just an AI that helps you after you create. It's there with you while you're creating. It's a creative co-pilot in real time. This could change everything. From content creation to how we think about video itself. It's not just post-production anymore. It's live production powered by generative intelligence. Mirage is still limited to a resolution of 768 by 432 pixels, though HD and 4K support are on the way. You'll also notice occasional weirdness, like faces distorting when you move too fast, or frame blending glitches. It runs best on high-end GPUs, and there's a learning curve to prompt tuning. But considering where we were even a year ago, this is mind-blowing progress. And the future? It's coming fast. Descartes is already testing mobile apps for iOS and Android. They're working on voice prompts, facial consistency, even style switching on the fly. Soon, you could be streaming to thousands while literally building the world around you with your voice and imagination. The implications are massive. Education, therapy, storytelling, games, art, even virtual worlds and the metaverse. Mirage isn't just a tool. It's a bridge between raw creativity and live experience. It's not just about what you create, but how you experience creating it. The first ever world transformation model turning any video, game or camera feed into a new digital world in real time. Unlike other AI video models with 10 plus second delays and 5 tens clips, Mirage transforms infinite video streams in real time. Mirage comes with a variety of additional video models, audio, emotions, music. They are building the platform that turns all our senses into portals. Today, you can play with Mirage on any device to teleport your surroundings, games, and films to new universes with different laws of physics and magic. They are regularly releases of model upgrades and additional features, including facial consistency, voice control, and precise object control. Mirage LSD is the first system to achieve infinite, real-time video generation with zero latency. LSD supports fully interactive video synthesis, allowing continuous prompting, transformation, and editing as video is generated. Using Mirage LSD, it is now possible to create a new variety of interactive experiences that weren't previously possible before. To generate video in real time, a LSD has to operate causally, producing each frame based only on frames that came before it. Real-time generation requires each frame to be produced in under 40 milliseconds in order to not stand out to the human eye. Together, 
These techniques yield a 16x improvement in responsiveness over prior models, enabling live video generation at 24 FPS. Recent efforts in video generation have advanced visual quality and clip duration, but most systems still lack one or more of the following interactivity, low latency, and temporal stability. Fixed length models like MovieGen 1 and VAO generate high quality video clips, but their non causal design and full clip inference introduce latency and prevent real-time interaction or extension beyond predefined lengths. Autoregressive models such as Cosvid, LTX, and Seaweed generate longer sequences by conditioning each chunk on prior outputs. While this improves scalability, chunked inference still limits responsiveness and suffers from error accumulation, capping generation length and ruling out true interactivity. Controllable generation methods, including ControlNet and LoRa-based adapters, Enable targeted editing and style transfer, but require offline fine-tuning and are not suited to live frame-by-frame -frame prompting. Diffusion models generate images or video by gradually denoising. So here's the big question. What would you do with real-time video transformation? Would you stream a space station tour? Turn your meetings into fantasy adventures? Host a podcast from a digital rainforest? Drop your wildest ideas in the comments. Don't forget to like. Sa share and most importantly subscribe to ideaplex for more mind-bending tech every single week this is just the beginning until next time stay creative stay curious and as always stay unreal